my show, underground kitchen, bitch, look at here, bitch, oh, oh, Mike Trench, bitch. You were chugging the whole thing? Yeah. <coughs> that what the fuck does that get you high or something? <coughs> does that get you get Damn, you high? My, oh my stomach, bro. Bro, you're gonna get a liver disease. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Or, forbid, but you get you gonna get some fucking lung stones. I mean, liver stuff. Oh, man. Liver stones. That is not easy. That is not easy. Like, this dude, um, Ban Badland Chugs, he drinks, like, a whole gallon of milk, Sunny D, Coke. Oh, my God. It Bro, looks easy in the video. This lady just fucking bar bur burped the other day on a video, and she was crying because it hurt so much. She was like, ah! I'm like, lady, Bro. what the fuck are you doing? But they get views like that. You gotta do what you do for the views, right? Damn, man. It's Listen, not how easy it looks in the videos. I wanted to talk. Oh, let me introduce you. Everybody out there in the world. We're back to England, huh? This is a yeah. boy, chap. I'm a, I'm a fucking boy. And I'm a chap. And I'm bumble to you, my friend. I speak that language, man. Oh, how the fuck? Did you get suspended for two weeks? It was two weeks or one? Uh, two weeks. Fuck. Okay, all of you watching, this is how I got suspended, all right? This is the story of a boy chap and his, his suspension for the shit school of racism. Okay, so it was like the last day of, um, you know, like term, you know, Friday. We're having an Easter brunch. It was, it was stupid. I mean, you got Easter and you got brunch. Fuck Fridays, let's just go. Nah, we gotta come to school for Friday brunch, whatever it was. So everyone's eat, every, like, it lasts till 11. So, like, you know, easy, go home, but no, nah, I don't want to. So, like, what happened was this, right? I'm literally, you know, running off with my friend because school's trash. And, like, shit happens so fast. We don't know where we're supposed to go because they don't have, like, we have a times table, but they won't show us the times table because, like, it's the last day and no one gives a fuck. So, I don't know where I'm supposed to go. So, me and my friend, we, we don't know where to go. It's a Friday. And there's usually, like, activities. We don't know where to go still. So, you know what they decide to do? They decide right. to call people up and take us to isolation where we can be safe. Because no, in my so, school... Uh, it... oh, real quick. What type of activities do you have at your school? Because when I was in school, we used to have, like, a pep rally. But I was never allowed to go. Field day, wow. I was never allowed to be there. Um, pizza day, my classroom never won. Hmm. You know, all types of sh so what'd you what'd your school do? We did fucking cooking, technology class, like crap, Damn. fucking sports, Lego clubs, um science, rule science, coloring, candle making, art. I used to I did a fucking I did a ton of like I used to do art so many times, but I wasn't on the art activity for some reason. But I'm fucking good at art, bro. Let me let me have a pic. Ah, oh, sh. What are you doing? My... Do? Bro, this is what I drew. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, Damn. and I was in science one you time. I was in science it. one time. Oh, you see it? Bro, look at this. Well, I really can this. Hold see on. it. I really can see it. You see it? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, bro. This, this bottom, shit right, right here, here like items at the bottom. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. You got like um uh can you see it well? Yeah. Yeah. Alright, so like you got the you got the guy here. That was like um from like a, a video, like an animated creepypasta story. So I drew him. These things at the bottom are basically like, you know, like demons and like knives, guns, you know, like demonic shit like that. And Bro, on the back it... always keep doing that style. That's what I know, man. You. Learn it from you. Mental. Yeah, You're man. like that Mr. Miyagi, bro. Mr. Yeah, Miyagi. Yeah, bro, and then... I swear to God, and then... I, bro, there was this guy, I told him I told him that too. 
And people like, bro, I drew this just fucking around. Just the just the other day. I haven't been doing art. I do little weird shit like this. It's Which is still like, fucking dope though. Yeah, it's just like, bro, it's different, right? But a lot yeah, of no. people are it's not like, like they're gonna be like, oh, what the fuck is that? They, you know, they're gonna make fun of it. You just gotta do what you want. And I, I was just bored. I was just smoking, and I was like, let me just do something that I don't give a fuck about. I just started I doing know. it, and it looked good. I know. But like, back to the story, okay? So, like, with me and my friend, all right, we're both Muslim, okay? We're, we're both Muslim, right? So, we're just, like, walking around and shit like that, but we don't know where to go. They're, they're going to try and put us in isolation. So, what we do is we run. We go inside a classroom, right? The teacher's in there, and we're like, can we stay here? The, we don't know where to go. She don't want us in here because she's trying to go to lunch. So we just chill in there. And then other people come in, they lock us in there and, and call the people. So they're waiting for us to go. So like, we don't want to go. And, it, and then a, a few minutes later, we go out and they offer us a chance to do some sports. So like, I'm sitting on the sideline because there's too many players. And I don't like football because, well, no, soccer. You guys call it soccer over America. So I don't oh, like soccer. So American football, soccer. Oh, you play soccer. a lot of soccer. Yeah. But, like, I stopped playing it because, you know, fucking legs. Anyway, so, like, he's playing soccer, and he tells me, yo, Ali. I said, well, I'm going to say some of my words in American so your viewers understand. So he says, yo, Ali, and I say, what? After this, we got to go. I don't want to stay here. He's like, okay, cool. So me and him decide, after one match, we go. So what I do is this. I'm, I got a wooden, like, I'm carving a wooden knife, you know, like, you know, just trying to practice my throwing because of, like, archery and all that kind of shit. So we both run out, and there's like an exit door for like fires and shit. We pushed that. Wooden knife? Yeah, yeah. Like a, there was a piece of wood enough on the floor, so I took um another like piece of wood, and it was like sharp. So I started like scraping it, and then I was like, you know, like just sharpening out. And I was I used to throw these um DIY knives at like fucking walls and shit when I was a kid. I don't do that much, but you know, Damn, I you can't really leave that. that behind when I'm bored. How do you make that? Anyways, we'll we'll talk about those knives at the end. Um, go, yeah, go ahead yeah. with this. Okay, so, all right, here's what happened, right? Oh, no, 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 no. Sorry about that. Uh, go ahead with the story. You fucking calm down my trench. <laughs> Damn. All right, anyway, guys, so, like, <laughs> what I was trying to do, we, we ran out, right? The other people in there, my you know. Tre- my trench. Listen. Okay, so these four people, right? Sorry There's, like, about four people that, hey, boy. Okay. Uh, you buy me up, um, we... we we're like the fucking, uh, what's the, oh, I forgot that one show, it's like, they go back in time and they fucking, oh, it started, um, Drake we'll talk about that at, at the end, yeah, yeah, jo- oh, I forgot the name, anyway, so like, what happened was this, okay, so like, we're running, for- Lewis and Clark, yeah, we're like Lewis and Clark, we're like Lewis and Clark, that re- what I just said reminded you of what the fuck you were thinking of, <laughs> yeah, Anyway, so like what happened was this. We we run out right <laughs> fuck okay. <laughs> you run out like a we fucking run out. Man. We run out right. And um, you know, there's like all of them are inside, like some of the all these all these teachers who do sports are cool, except for a few. But they don't even chase us, they just let, we're just running, okay? We turn around and uh, we decide to escape the school. Alright, because there was a shop nearby and there was the woods nearby, so I'm thinking we just chill out for the whole day. And, you know, cause problems. Because, you know, that's what kids do when they're fucking bored. I'm just joking. We never did nothing all about that. What we wanted to do, we was like, going back to the housing unit. Like, you just wanted to skip. Why the fuck are you trying to skip, man? You gotta bro. You gotta, no, so we don't know where we're supposed to be. They literally gave us no direction, no profile, nothing. They just told us... Oh. Fucking make office. It's like, it's like walking into a bank. Well, the back lady wasn't at the front, so I just went in a fucking uh, bolt and I stole the million dollars. <laughs> but if you fucking listen, then I can complete my fucking story. But anyway, what happened was this, okay? <laughs> so, <laughs> I'm fucking losing it right now. It's because there's damn, damn diabetes. It's because there's diabetes. Get out of here. Anyway, so like what happened was this. I just, okay, sorry, sorry, little dicky. Earth, earth pollution no more, my guy. All right, anyway. So, like, what happened was this, right? <laughs> what happened was this, fucking stupid. We went to the housing unit, 
we went to the house in Eden, right? And me and, me and my friend Muhammad, again, I got to use the American term, I kind of was, you know, how to pronounce it. So we both are like, let's go to the housing unit, American term. which is called Shackleton. Every housing unit in my school is named after some kind of famous person who died in the 1800s or the past. I don't know why, but yeah, so it was called Shackleton. And it's Shackleton who died on a boat somewhere. I don't care about him. Fucking died eating some fish and tuna, but I don't care. Anyway, we go to Shackleton, right? And we're trying to like go in to just chill. We're trying to piss off one of the uh, one of the Jamaican guys, Rasta man, Rasta most. <laughs> so like um, you know, the teacher, the teacher spots us and she thinks we're trying to break her and break in the house. When it, when we go there to get our clothes and shit, so she you knows she does. She goes on the radio and says, "Can I have some support, please?" And as soon as she said that, we both run. Now, I'm a fat fuck, right? I got big ass legs, titties. <laughs> I don't know if people are going to look at me like, oh, he's <laughs> running or am I running to the, or I'm running to the brunch lunch table. But you know what they decide to do? Um, they, they don't chase us. They walk slowly to us because I'm a fat fuck. And we try and escape from the blue gate because they're chasing us. And I know if they'll chase us, they'll break us down and try and, I don't know, do some shit like that. But, you know, we run and uh, three people corner us and they're like, they don't get angry at me. They get angry at my friend because because he's younger than me. He's like 13. I'm 14. Well, yeah. wait. His birthday is... Oh, he's 14. He's 14. So we're both the same age, right? But he's in a different year. They look at us and then one of them goes, Why are you running off? Ali, you're so smart. Why do you have to make this decision? And I say nothing because yeah. anything I say is going to be used against me. So my other friend, yeah, he's like, he's getting verbal... You know, they're saying he's stupid. They say if we left you with the older kids, you'd be shitting yourself. So what they make us do is to make us walk back, all right? Now, I tell my friend, just stay calm. We can just get out of here because I'm not feeling to get in trouble for some shit we never did, all right? All right. So you know what they call us? They call us the two Asians. Now, in England, Asians basically means Indians, Pakistani, and, you know, any other, I don't know, quote-unquote Muslim wanted i don't know some shit like that they call us asians and i got pissed off and i told my friend because i'm not going to go scream at them and they'll make things worse so i tell my friend they called us asians man that's some label racism and i was thinking to myself why would they call us asians because they don't know who what where i'm from i'm moroccan i'm not fucking asian and i was thinking also I, I, the next day how are they going to call me asians when what the fuck are koreans then monkeys who knows but you know they, they're kind of retarded you don't call Pakistanis Asians or Indian Asians. It's stupid. So you know what I do? This is what my dumbass does. I see a white, um, I see like a white automatic door that we broke through. I forgot to mention that, by the way. We broke through to get outside. Okay. Now, I try and run through that. The teachers cat. Shit. <laughs> Yo, that was some good fucking timing. As soon as I said catch, I caught my phone. Damn. Fucking. That's so amazing timing. So they catch me, and I'm, like, getting restrained. And, uh, oh, fuck, nuggets. Okay. And what happens is this. So, like, they put me in isolation, and there's four fucking people just wanting me to go in, all right? This is where lunchtime happens, and my friend is, um, he's not in, he's not in isolation with me. We're separated. Because if we were together, we'd fuck up, like, four or five or six or seven teachers all at once. Because he's fucking tall. I'm fucking short, but I'm probably one of the strongest in my year. But, you know, this is not the time for um, flexing, you know what I'm saying? I mean, here at Underground Kitchen, we do not flex. No, no, we do not flex. Okay, anyway. Bro, why don't you just throw that watch? Can that watch tell the time? Uh, what if I told you it was from um, uh, a, fake, a fake Chinaman in uh, Morocco? Would you believe that? Does it, does it tell the time? Oh no, that's a fake watch. It's like two pounds. You you, you 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 told me before underground before this underground kitchen, Adam Sandler had like a two pound watch, and there there's my one. Well, no, two dollar, but you know. Anyway, so back to yeah, my story. They told me you fucking you didn't you, you didn't comprehend what I was saying. You were supposed to keep that watch, not destroy it. To hell with that man. That was. That was a, f a Chinaman um, gave it to my auntie and pretended it was real. I refused to go into the room. And you know what they start doing? They start restraining me. I like, I'm like, get the fuck off me, man. So, like, what happens was this. I punch one of them. I punch the other guy. 
And then afterwards, they restrain me. I get back up and I sit down, okay? But his thing though, yeah, they were restraining me while I was sitting down. And I made one of my legs, like my, my left leg. They were trying to take my shoes off because they knew I couldn't run out with, with um, just socks. So what I do is I, I kick the, the, one of the teachers was start take, trying to take my shoes off. So I kicked him out the way and I pushed him into the other teacher sitting down. Okay? So like the one teacher this was shit. holding my legs. I did some Jackie Chan shit. I just kicked him to the side and he was in position. So I just pushed my leg and he just jumped in front of the other guy. And then I was like loosening my arms and shit. You know, it was amazing. But then they Hold put on. me to the ground and then I got back up and when I calmed down. Uh, two weeks ago, Friday. But listen, I'm not finished though. I'm not finished yet. This, all and of what? you watching, this is, this what is they true. Do to you? Bro, nothing. All I said was I'm not going to go sit down. I want to sit with my, um, my classmates in the, in the lunchroom. It's not my fault if I'm being a bad student. You guys don't even offer me no fucking passport. And you guys... Anyway, that's the story. Passport for what? What the fuck you need a passport for? They fucking give me a passport to know where my destination is. My school's retarded. I go to an anger school, okay? They're all stupid people. It's I always mean, I don't, I'm not even that angry. Damn, man. This school's stupid. But anyway, back to what I was saying. If there's like so something like, that you want to talk about, if there's like uh, someone, like a death or something, or something that you want to cut out, anything you want to cut out from the show that you don't feel comfortable with, just let me know and I'll edit it. I know. I'm okay with everything. I want everyone to know every single detail that I'm about to say, right? So what happens is this. I get back up from my seat and, you know, they're like, like just telling me to oh. calm down and everything, but I don't want to speak to none of them, right? So the guy in front of me says, hey, Ali, why do you hate me? And this guy, I hate him so much. I hate his guts. He hates Muslims. And I told him that. And you know what he says to me? He says, I don't hate Muslims. He shows me pictures of, of um, people he's been with to restaurants and shit. And they ain't even Muslims. Some of them are fucking Indian. And I say to him, you don't even know those people. They're just taxi drivers. You're still racist. Because you know, you know this motherfucker, right? He's been in the army before. Why Listen. Why would you give a fuck what they think about anyway? No, because they keep on fucking, uh, like, attacking me with words and shit. And I'm like, fuck you, this. I'll retaliate back, you know what I'm saying? But they always want to fucking ignore that piss me off. Fucking... I'm just ignoring ignore them, bro. But they keep on doing it, man. It's hard to ignore people sometimes, man. Trust me. But, like, here's what I do. I push, I push my balance here, and I get myself away. But they won't let me. And I'm saying, I don't want to speak to you. Move away. He says, no, you're not moving me anywhere. And I said, fuck off now. I stood up and said it to him. He's like, oh, what are you going to do? <laughs> I punched him in the oh, chest, oh, and then these, and then these other guys are just like restraining my arms. They're like this. They're like they put your arm, like they wrap their arm around you like this, and they pull you. So like I was just slipping out, and I started punching all of them. All right, and well, then uh, like, they put me down. On the, me they put me down on the up, sofa. Okay? They put me down on the sofa, so I start punching them again. Then they put me down in the fucking Jesus position. Like the the two of them are like on my arms. The one is on my legs. I'm fucking. My arms are hurting a little bit, but I don't care. But this is the third attempt I try this. The third time gets fucking crazy. Everybody watching Underground Kitchen, fucking like and subscribe to Mike fucking Trenchy and his beautiful dog, who I don't know the name of, but you know. Why don't you be promoting in the middle of the goddamn show? Say what the fuck you're saying. You don't need to promote nothing, partner. This ain't okay, no scam. bro. I miss being on your show. Anyway, so like... <laughs> I'm what, sorry the third time that. gets crazy. My subscribers, I'm sorry about that. You don't have to subscribe okay. if, if you don't want, okay? But if you I do recommend. want to okay. subscribe. Anyway. All right, so anyway. All right, here's what happens, okay? No, I'm going to look that. at the camera while I say this. All right, guys, listen. I run, yeah. I run to the fucking, um, like, there's a fire exit near the kitchen. I sprint to that like a fast mother. I was like Usain Bolt. I ran to that. But here's what happens. I pushed, I barged past the two of the teachers. And one of them manages to tackle me on the sofa. So I'm punching the one guy. And then the other guy comes to restrain my right arm. So I headbutt him with the back of my skull. And the third guy jumps on all of us and pushes the sofa down. Like the sofa's here. This is the sofa we're on. And this is the sofa next to it. This one pushes. The other one breaks from the bottom. It's like, it's like this. It like breaks like that. To the sofa. Like this sofa's down. I'm, I flip over. And then like they're all on top of me. Sugar spill on the floor. And the person who's in my housing unit, those two women with me, you know what they start doing? They don't want to speak to me. They laugh at me while I'm getting restrained. And they call the cops. They call the police. Because I <laughs> assaulted them. And you know what you the cops do? They turn man. up. 
You know what they did? They turned up and then all of them brought fucking tasers, right? In a police van. Parked where the fucking school is. Everybody out looking their windows are looking at me like I'm a fucking madman. But here's the thing though. This could have all been avoided if one, I had some fucking guidance. Two, there wasn't racist people in the school. And three, where the fuck am I supposed to go? <laughs> anyway, so the police Ooh. come and you know what the police are like, right? The police say, oh, if you do this to us, you'll get your ass kicked. They were like, all oh, of that. But, you know, I didn't care. I was just asking for some water because I was screaming and my throat hurt. No dirty jokes in mind, by the way. But anyway, here's what happened, right? <laughs> here's what happened, right? Yeah, yeah, because I was telling them to get the fuck off me and get the fuck off. But then it, here's the thing, though, yeah. One of them had a broken, yeah. broken like, tooth and oh, no, yeah, bleeding. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> You're making excuses, yeah. You're making excuses. Yo, bastard, listen to my story, yeah? Were you supposed anyway. to do Yeah. Why are you not paying Listen. attention in class when you're supposed to be paying attention and everybody not paying attention and you go along and not pay attention with them? Because it's because the school is um uh, how you say how you say uh the uh you retarded. Uh, you yes retarded. <laughs> Yes retarded this school is um uh how you say No stupid. you No you <laughs> Oh I I I remember. Okay, so the police came, right? They had tasers and everything. And I just, I just, uh, here's what I fucking did stupidly. I looked at them and I said, fuck you. Fuck you. And, and then afterwards, and afterwards, this is what happened. They were surprisingly calm with me, even though I said that. They didn't care. One of them sat down. They looked at me. One of them had a bold head. I don't know why police officers have bold heads, but I guess it's in case they want to show bruises or some shit. shit. But I know I've been I've been in some bad situations. I know all the pop, all the people with bald heads are angry son of a bitches. But anyway, they talk to me and I get along with them. I told them my side and they give me some valuable information. If they make you angry, don't ignore them. But here's what here's where shit kicks off, right? They start to bring up stuff from ages ago that I never knew they thought of. Okay, here's what one of them said, right? The guy who said um, the guy who I really hate. He was restraining me. He goes to the police and says, he says these things, all right? He says these things. I brought in, um, I brought in these, okay? I brought in these to attack people with. He says, I made the wooden knife to stab someone. That's two. And the other guy mentions that I assaulted my, my grandma. And, like, for twice. Even though what happened was we had an argument because of some fucking um, doctor situation. But that's three. And I, t I, I got pissed off at him. I said, no, that's not what happened. And you know what he instantly said? He said, sorry, um, maybe there was a misinterpretation of the information I was given. Like, what the fuck, my guy? You're going to lie to them? You're going to lie to their faces? You're going to just switch through everything? Because what happened you think you that? don't... What are you talking dickhead, about? man. What happened between you and that guy? What is that that you're talking about? Okay, so he mentioned something about what happened, like, ages ago with an argument with me and my grandma. And I'm like thinking to myself, how the fuck does he know this information? This guy's going to be a fucking dead man as soon as I leave. Because this is going to have no job. When I come visit, I ain't going to speak to him. He's just a prick. I don't like that guy. I don't want to call his name out in case people want to attack him, but hell no. I'm not going to even mention my school. All you guys got to know is that UK is just a trash no, fucking... Trash <laughs> trash people. <laughs> what the fuck are you, you streaming? <laughs> <laughs> like fucking strange bro. Anyway, so like I go home and you know what I got from my present after attacking full grown men? You know what I got? What? I got fucking two games, my guy. No swear, I'm not swearing. Two games and two meals. Double. <laughs> well, I'm not joking. I'll show you now. Nah, I don't want to fuck up my setup, but listen, I'll actually. So Wait, be, be, with, guy, with the last guy that you were just talking to, you said you had you got into it with his grandma. No, times. no, he was mentioning my grandma, bro, because we had an argument or some shit, and he mentioned that to the cops, thinking I would get in more trouble because the cops were fine, bro. They don't care. They four of them, four police. I'm fucking young, and they're like grown men with experience. They've been stabbed and shit, and they don't want to arrest me. I, it was confusing. I, I guess. All right, just so let's be honest. Be honest right now. Do you think that there's other people talking about this incident? Fuck tons, man. Fuck tons, man. Fuck it's tons. not even the worst part. 
Right. It's not Two. even the worst part. I'm gonna get to the I'm gonna get to the actual serious part and then we move on to the good shit. Alright. The good Just, shit. Yes. Oh, oh, get to the good yeah, shit. Bro, that's what we're talking. We're gonna talk about Cobra Kai. We're gonna talk about yeah. fucking futures of money and all that good stuff, man. And then Mike can speak how Stay much he fucking drugs, wants. Kid. Stay away from drugs. <laughs> yeah, man. I know I wish I would have. Psych. <laughs> yeah. I, I got a, I got some fucking other racist like fucking Muhammad Ali. <laughs> That's some good ass. Um, I don't know bong. I'm gonna say bong. I could be. Uh, wrong. Is that a bong? Yeah, it is. All right. Anyway, what uh, what was I? Oh, yeah. So my friend, oh. right? Pause for a minute. That fucking beautiful man. I wish. I had one of them, but you know, I don't smoke because smoking is bad for you. It's <laughs> bad. Bro, if you if you fucking finish school, <coughs> you can do whatever the fuck you want. <coughs> exactly. Cool. Finish high school. Once you finish high school, you have a mature brain. Then you can experiment. But you can't be like doing that shit now. Mm-hmm. Can't be doing that know, shit man. now. Mm-hmm. Anyway, where was I? This is the serious part, right? It's so my friend, yeah. Once, right, once my friend, bro. You can graduate from high school and you fucking. Mm-hmm. I'm cutting you off, sir. I'm cutting you off. Exactly. Exactly. Listen, but um. Fucking school, wait, man. You lucky I don't. You lucky I don't. Fan my head or something because. Listen. <laughs> no, uh. Yeah, bro. If you if you if you want to try weed or something like that, or if you're thinking about even drinking fucking beer, wait till you're after done with high with, um high school, bro. Mm-hmm. That's not a bastard. That's not a soda. Is that soda? Woo woo. <laughs> soda kills. Hmm. No. Uh, okay. All right. I anyway, I better drink soda. I I I like. I used to like it a lot. I used to drink soda fucking twenty four seven. I'm just, I ain't gonna do that to my coin. I was just I was just thinking something. I should put this ancient fucking coin in this uh, cap cap to make the quality. Nah. Put soda in it. Nah, I was gonna do, I was gonna do something stupid, but you know I wasn't. I stopped what myself. A, That's a smart what thinking. A, what do you mean? I need a case for that fucking coin. This coin, this coin right here is ancient, man. Like this, this coin was made in 2007. These were manufactured because in 1807, that's when slavery started, and uh, it's to cel- it's Listen, bro, what, what do you celebrate? With that? What do you feel? Okay, motherfucker. Yeah, everybody knows 1807. Yes, that has a little chain on it, so it's a slavery. Listen, yeah, like, I, yeah. 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 Please, it's not a, you get it's not it. the fucking coin. It's the fucking. It's the. It's I'm trying to tell you something. I'm trying to it's, tell you something. Relax, go. What is it, buddy? Relax, calm down. <laughs> calm down. <laughs> That's what they were doing to you. Hold him. Hold him. <laughs> and you're like, ah. Get the Hold fuck him. off. He's a fucking crazy ass kid. Call the police. <laughs> Call the yeah. police. Yeah. He's assaulted a fucking 32 year old man. Headbutt him. He's a crazy vigilant. Police comes. Oh, what's the problem here? He's assaulted us. Why? Why? What's the problem? I don't know. Even though we're trained in the arts of restraining Hello. people, he doesn't know. I don't know. <laughs> Stop. Stop. The police. The police was like, "What the fuck is he? What the fuck is this problem, man?" The police was more braver than the fucking fucking teachers, bro. They were shit scared, man. How are you gonna call the police after three attacks? Are they stupid? They're fucking. One of them is a veteran. One of them's fifty-seven. One of them's thirty-two and is a is an athlete. And they're scared of a fourteen-year-old. Are you stupid? Oh, what the You're fuck? supposed to be grown men, but no, police. They're wanting to. Nah, here's the thing. There's a, there's a, there's two types of things: getting attention and. Oh. <laughs> what the fuck is? Listen. It's okay, no. What the fuck were you saying when they were holding on to you? Oh, I was just swearing, you know, basic stuff. Get the fuck off of me. Don't touch me. Go fuck yourself. I'll kill your family. Fuck off. Go kill your sister. I was saying types of stuff like that. <laughs> You said he's a <laughs> 32-year-old man. Yes, he was an athlete. He could have restrained me by himself, but no, they needed to call the cops, which is stupid because the cops didn't do anything. Man, what do you want him to do? Kill you on the ground? 
No, no well, at least try and come. Oh, nah, his, his thing. They say it's restraining, but... In Florida, this is what they do. They call it like this. Boom! That's what they would have done Bro. to you. <laughs> I know. I know. Boom! They would have threw you but on the least, fucking... But at, least, but at least tried to do something other than try and break my fucking arm. But the police didn't even do nothing. They just called... I calmed down when they called the police, but when the police came, we just told them to fuck off, and they just did Here's the thing though, police are not allowed to attack you unless you attack them first. They came with tasers because they thought I was too aggressive to handle, but since I calmed down at the soon as um, they mentioned the cops, I instantly, you know, I could have regretted it more, but I decided not to go further because I'm not going to get arrested for punching up three people even though I absconded from fuck all. But anyway, back to the story. So my friend, right, now nah, this, is, this is fucking true, my friend, right, uh, he, he got suspended for two days for attacking teachers. You know why? You know why? He went to the bathroom, took a piss. Two minutes later, they come, they, the two of them say, you're going to isolation. He says, why? You're on high risk. We're talking about this again? No, yeah, bro. I want to mention it, man. They tell him. They tell him, they fu they tell him right, they tell him that he, he's going to isolation because he's high risk. The guy took a piss. He had a note from the teacher saying he's about to go to the toilet. What? You know what isolation is? What is isolation, Milad? Now you can speak. All Thank right. you. Go. Let's let go. You, there you go. Now. Fuck you. Uh, go. <laughs> Doctor go. Evil. All right. Here's what happened, right? Yeah, exactly. Isolation is basically where, um, like, if you're bad or you want to stay there or they send you there if you do something bad or you want to just chill out there, they'll put you in there. You basically, if you're bad, you do work all day until you sent, you're sent home, like, to your housing unit and then go home. Or you could stay there for an entire day or two or a whole week. If you miss school, if you skip school, they'll put you in there another day. If you miss two days, two days of isolation, they'll double it. So every time you miss a day, they double it. Two will be four, four will be eight, etc., etc. It that's how it works. And um, if you miss a whole week or two weeks, you how it works. Let me tell you how it works in my. Life. I'm cutting you off. It's I'm cutting. I'm cutting you. Yeah. I did the bonage, but the bonage. I'm making trench. When they cut someone you off, I cut someone you off. So do the Blasky one in this meal. My fish one again. In Miami, when I was younger. Okay, me lad. They sent me to detention class. There was a lady that looked at the old middle witch from the fucking Wizard of the Oz. Mm -hmm. Green bitch. It's events. It's it's. So I continue when I uh, I'm in the back of the classroom and everybody has a dictionary. But what you have to do is non-stop right. The diction, the dictions on every word dictionary, all the way up and down, back and front, every page until the end of the day. If you get talk, caught talking, you go to the top of the classroom, and if you get caught talking again, you get another day. I seen, well, why I don't know why the fuck I'm talking like this. I seen a fucking uh, a girl. She was right next to me, so I'm in class, and the teacher. The teacher's like, oh, if you keep up with that fucking language, you're going to get another day. She's like, I don't give a fuck. That's another day. <laughs> Bitch, shut the fuck up. That's another day. Um, She's like, I'm fucking leaving. That's another day. You have four days now. And if I was you, I would get started on the dictionary. Well, she was like, so now you literally have to do three days. Um, Just sitting there in a fucking chair all day. That's bad for your blood. It can give you a heart attack. You know? <laughs> like this fucking coke. <laughs> like, like if I actually, if they actually send me to detention every time I did something bad, there will be a skeleton in the back of the classroom. And me under the detention chair because I done been there so With much. Fucking cobwebs and shit, and they'll be like, they'll be like fucking <laughs> dust balls rolling around, fam. They'd be like fucking students with the pens, and then like when you grab the pen from the student, it'll just break and shit. The bones will become dust, and this evil bitch with the fucking de devil horns is like standing on the chair like a gremlin. 
saying, do your work before you get another idea. I could see that happening in my school if you swear you get another day. They tried that only with me one time, and then the second time, well, I threw a, a desk on a fucking kid, and he was like, he was talking shit about me, bro. Always. Fuck him. Yeah, he was crying. He was like, <laughs> quiet, <laughs> quiet. It was a quiet. Like if he, if he had it on mute, you would think, damn, why is this not mute? I want to hear it. <laughs> and it's on mute, would not hear it because there was nothing. He was. <laughs> I knew a kid just like that. Yeah, no, it was he was a that. retardy kid, by the way. I threw like a chair on him. He was a, he was a kid with the spiky hair. Bigger <laughs> than me, always trying to bully me. And I remember that I punched him like a whole bunch of times after school. He didn't even feel it not <laughs> once. But anyways, <laughs> I punched him in the stomach like this. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you fucking <laughs> go kill it. kicked his ass, man. All he was doing was looking down, but he got. <laughs> I jumped, and then um, there was another kid there. <laughs> I told this story a whole bunch of times. There was another kid there. This is middle school, and I went up to him to fuck him up. This motherfucker looked, grabbed me. I'm like, this motherfucker flipped me. Hey, hey. <laughs> I <laughs> My fucking feet landed like this. God. <laughs> so hard. <laughs> 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 so hard. Uh, my knees, I thought it's a shock. Oh my fucking guy. I'm surprised my knees didn't go to my anchor. Bro, but, um, so this motherfucker ended up getting jumped by like a whole bunch of my friends, you know. <laughs> <laughs> what a fucking amazing story, bro. That, rem that reminds me of another fucking story, bro. <laughs> He landed. This is the best part. This is the best part. That's not even the best part. He yeah, landed. Yeah, he told me this. Behind, behind a palm tree. Yeah, there was yeah. a palm tree like this, and I fucking dove in between. Like I was, like <laughs> he I was told me this before. <laughs> you fucking kicked him in the fucking thing, man. Continue. Sorry about that. Oh my god, yo! I knew it. Okay, back to my story before I before I get to my next one. Uh, Right now, right? I can save it after we're done. Like download it. I don't have to download it right now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go, let's try and go for a longer, like a, like a, like a long. Fuck, I can't talk about it properly. Let's go for like a, a longer, you know, pod so you can speak more. Cause my dumb ass keeps speaking all the way. But after these two yeah, just things, talk. I'm gonna, just like gonna shut the fuck up. You did fucking great. What are you talking about? Let's let's keep let's continue, right? Let's go back to my story, okay? Because um, I'm clearly more important here. Yeah, no, I'm clearly more important than you. Shut the fuck up! <laughs> You're doing very great. I'm your... proud of you, my lad. I'm hey, proud of you, man. Thank you. <laughs> Thank I'm going to fucking stop right now. Okay, like okay here's what happened, right? So they stop him and they say, You're on high risk. And he's like, I didn't do nothing. <laughs> and then he's like, I've got an isolation. And he's like, Why? What? You know what they decide to do? They say, get the f get over here. And they restrain him. You know what he does? He punches them up. Like, he's told, he, he called me and he punched them up. And they, um, you know, they put him in isolation. The, the, the bold black guy, yeah, says, do you work? Do you work, Mohammed? He's like, no, I'm not fucking doing my work. And the guy's like, what did I say to you? Do you work? I'll be in isolation in Frobisher next week. And he's like, fuck off, not doing work. And he says, watch your language. So he grabs him, yeah. And the guy, my friend Mohammed punched him in the face. And he's like, right, come over here. And he starts training him, so he starts punching. They they tried to call the police, but they didn't do it. <clears throat> so, here we are. You know, I don't hit the ganoush. I'm high. I would take a hit for you guys right now before I leave, but this... Woo! I'm high as shit. I am a... Uh... And this is today's awesome, very extravagant bonus clip. <laughs> Welcome to the bonus clip. I'm gonna be showing off my air sports gun. We're gonna we're gonna shoot some targets and we're gonna see we're gonna see what happens. 
I got a beach ball. We're gonna we're gonna see if it pops. I got a fucking hey, two villains over here. I gotta draw their faces. Hey, but first of all, let me let me smoke and hit this shit. If you wonder why is there a bonus clip, there's not. I don't always do bonus clips, but whenever an emergency happens during an episode, like let's say I do an episode for forty minutes, and something happens. Sometimes I might have to do a bonus clip just to make it like, you know, so you can get your money's worth. Because you're paying money. No, you're not paying shit. I look like a whole man. Alright, so let's get started with the, uh, with the bonus clip. So I purchased this for ten dollars. A lot of people were like, "What? Ten dollars? Why would you spend that?" Listen, it comes with a box. Okay, it comes with a box. You open it. What do you see? Two loaded handguns. <laughs> They're not loaded, but <coughs> it comes with some instructions, and it comes with these two fine, very fine guns. Look at these bad bitches. <laughs> you cock them. Shit loud as fuck. I think this one is louder than... Let me see if it's louder than this one. Oh, that's the same shit. Alright, so... We're gonna shoot with the gray one. Because this is Ashley's. <laughs> so we're gonna take care of this one. Put this one in here. Put it in the box. And these are the bullets. And then what's cool is that you could just press this button. And the clip falls out like it's a movie or something. Hey, put your... Freeze! Hold on, I gotta load it up. Freeze! Oh, I mean, let me change bullets. <laughs> Sorry about that. I'm, I'm crazy. Uh... Alright, so here we go. We're gonna set up these fucking targets. First, let me smoke. Where? <laughs> my fucking hair keeps getting in my face. I think it's about to rain, so we gotta we gotta hurry, but gotta draw the villains. We're gonna make them like two police officers or something. You know, sometimes they have mustaches. And, uh... Looks like the guy from KFC. Let's fucking do this one. <coughs> this is Trump. <coughs> Trump with his hair. We gotta make him sad because he's a sad hoe. <laughs> <coughs> All right, now that's I don't know if this, this look. Obviously, this fucking ball is not in a pop. We're gonna try, but we gonna try, but we gonna try. So this is how you load up the fucking clips. Look at this shit. So you take it out. You gotta like, you pull this shit down. You just, you just put them in there. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna load up six, three, four, five. Six. Yeah, let's do six. I don't want to put too much. Is it ready? Is it ready? Is she ready to go? Bop, 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 bop. Look, I got a cop's arm too. Hey, it's her. Please, sir. Hey, put your hands in there. Put your hands. I don't want to have to kill you, man. I don't want to. Let me talk to you. Let me see the papa. Ba, ba. It's not funny. All right, here we go. I 
shoot the rock, but. Okay. So obviously, if it hits the ball, it's gonna pop my eye. And a lot of people will be like, no, don't do, no. But it's for the entertainment, you know what I mean? If I pop my eye loose, if I lose my eye, I lose my eye. No, I got glasses right here. I could just put these bitches on. It will be good. Here we go. So this is a review of the Air Sports gun. A P328 OnePlus One uses six millimeter BB bullet. I believe it's loaded. I believe it's loaded. I'm gonna aim for this, for this one, for the Trump. Oh shit! Knock that motherfucker down. <coughs> for KFC. Woo! <coughs> Holy shit! Let's see if it went through. Well, it doesn't go through, but it hits it. Let me see. I'm gonna set them shits up again. Oh, right here. Little mark right here. It's pretty, yo, this shit is pretty accurate, right? Well, it's obviously not gonna pop the foot, so let's get the beach ball out the fucking way. Let's put another target. What can we put as a target? My head! Um. We could put like fucking. Fuck it. I'll just try to shoot them shits down again. Let me smoke. Let me smokes! <clears throat> And I just want to state a note that I got like 30 fucking, 30 different fucking 3D glasses from Disney. I always steal that shit. Every time I go on a ride, I just take the glasses with me. I don't know why. But here we go. How many bullets I got left? I think I got four, right? Oh, we got four or three? Oh, we got four. Trump, here I come, mother effort. <clears throat> well, this shit is accurate as fuck. So you can get these. Yeah, if you go to a flea market, you could probably get. Not, it's that they don't sell. But you could get one for $5. And it comes with these bullets. And then you could just restart it whenever you want. You know what I'm saying? How many bullets? And never you ne you can never leave it loaded. So and there's no way to take it out. So we gotta shoot it. We gotta shoot it. Let me set up the. I'm gonna set it up in the same spot. So that's four. That's four out of four. That's four out of four. <clears throat> That's it. Sometimes the, bu <clears throat> the bullets crack and sometimes they don't. And, uh, I don't know if it's like a big thing of air that pushes it out like shoots it or like a big hit i think it's air maybe both i'm not sure uh but that's cool anyways so that's it that's it for this episode uh oh we could chill for a bit let's chill for a little bit more i guess all right or should we try the black let's try the black one let's try the black it shoots the same Where's the ball? Let me hit this shit one more time. <clears throat> you know what I'm 
saying, just to, just to focus my vision. One in the chamber, one in the chamber. Loading up the clip, loading up the clip. Remember what I told you. Keep kicking ass, my guys and girls. I tell you. I better fucking hit this on my mom. You heard that bit that bit was swirling at the end. You heard that bit that bit was swirling. Now back to the show. And, um. That's about it, so, uh, oh yeah, so I'm about to do an episode of My Place 10, and if you guys don't know, you know, I'm usually, I'm not, I'm not, I don't promote, my thing is do not promote on this shit, bitch, do not promote on this shit, but if you do want to, like, let people know what you're doing, you can, um, so I'm about to do an episode of My Place 10, that's me playing PS4 games, y'all could check that out, maybe, like, right here or something, uh, no, not, not, not right here because it's not the end of the video, YouTube, I know I got the features with the video pops up, what am I talking about, <laughs> right here, let me hit this shit, let me hit this shit and sip on my double cup, you know what I mean, get a double cup, you know what I mean, look, 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 go ahead, no way, but, um, and I got the prank call show. I got um, skits. I'm a schizo. By the way, a girl died doing that fucking crack on her neck. Um, she ripped her car, her, her, her main vein, and now she's paralyzed. I don't. Know, I think she's probably dead. Now. I'm not sure if she's dead now, but she's paralyzed. So, uh, don't crack your neck hard. Uh, what the fuck am I talking about? What else I got going on? Listen, I got, I got a whole bunch of shit. Where's the list right here? Tinky Tuesday, the prank call show. Mike plays 10. Uh, and, 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 and a whole bunch of other shit, alright? So, yeah. Yeah. <laughs>